Okay, guys, so when it comes to removing your headlight, you've got two main bolts to remove, which is the one there, 10 mil uh, bolt. Some of them do have um, a Phillips screwdriver insert, but this one hasn't. And the other one is just there. Um, you can get in there with a flex. If you find you haven't got a flex, you've only got a, a bar, then if you just loosen off this one, also a 10 mil socket, you can bring forward your spotlight and then uh, obviously get better access to the headlight. And then you just give it a twist and um, it pulls out. But obviously you see that in the rest of the video. So yeah, there's only two bolts really you need to do. Worst case scenario, you've got your third one now. Okay. With those three bolts plus the one for the spotlight removed uh, this jiggles out obviously you can pull the uh, connector for the main light off that just slides out that's the connector there there's one down the bottom for the side light and there's this one for the motor so I'm going to disconnect those and then the headlamp will be free Okay, so get a metal screwdriver down there, just give it a little twist, that frees that out, it's popped out, and now we can remove that, that connector. And there you go, so you can tell which headlight it is because at the top there it says it's quite in drive, and then the right hand because um, looking at it between the new one which is left hand drive and this one it looks very very similar normally you can tell by the pattern inside there but on the top there and obviously the other ones going to have left hand drive right hand so for bulb changes um, for your side light if you've got the side light fitted on your um, your model um, you literally just twist it anti-clockwise a little bit stiff, especially with one hand, and then pull it out. And obviously you can upgrade that to LEDs, uh, which is what I'll be doing. But mine's, I've already got one of these back in the vehicle. And then obviously your main light, you've got the squeezes, so you just squeeze them up, they lift up, and then, yeah, so squeeze these together, and then they come out of the little little hooks down there and you see you take your bulb out. So 
I'll just stick with that one for now. And that will go back in place. Then you've got your rubber. Make sure you put that on. Keep it all nice and dry. Push that right down. That's it, and now we're ready to reinstall. So, reconnection. Probably start on the side, I think. Get that in first. test before you bolt it back in. Really pain. Should be 
a little bit of a hand. And then there we go. Get away with that, but it depends what tools you've got, I suppose. You've got the flex one. 